Soil testing or soil analysis is an important tool for recognizing a soil's agricultural potential. A thorough soil analysis will identify low nutrient levels, excessive nutrient levels, as well as other soil problems. A clinical soil analysis can help us determine what kinds of nutrients could be added to improve a soil's performance. The process of determining fertilizer requirements based on soil analysis can be put into the following formula. The plant requirements minus the amount in the soil equals the fertilizer needed. Here is the name of the compound that contains the nutrients. The carrier is often a combination of ions or salts. For example, ammonium sulfate is a carrier for nitrogen. Ammonium phosphate is a carrier for nitrogen and phosphorus. And steer manure is a carrier for nitrogen. Filler materials like gypsum and clay are sometimes added to fertilizers to adjust their grade. A neutralizer is a material which is added to a fertilizer to neutralize the acidity. Lime, calcium carbonate, and magnesium carbonate are common neutralizers. A conditioner is a substance used to coat fertilizer pellets to prevent them from sticking together. Conditioners are often made from waxes and clays. A fertilizer that causes chemical reactions in the soil that lower the soil pH by adding hydrogen ions would be called an acid-forming fertilizer. Ammonium phosphate would be considered an acid-forming fertilizer. A fertilizer that causes reactions in the soil system which increase the soil pH by reducing hydrogen ions would be termed a base-forming fertilizer. Potassium nitrate is an example of a base-forming fertilizer. Inorganic fertilizers are carbon-free materials containing nutrients in their pure chemical form. For example, ammonium nitrate. Inorganic fertilizers are usually derived from gases, minerals, and ores.